Hey everyone, it's John here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can change the default settings in SharePoint so that when you open your Excel files, they're gonna open in the desktop app rather than Excel online. Let's take a look. So here we are in SharePoint and we're in a document library named example and we've got an Excel file here. Now, if we click on this Excel file, the default behavior is that this is going to open in Excel online. So it's going to open a new browser tab and we're gonna see our file in Excel online. Let's close this. Now, if we want to open our Excel file in the desktop app, then we need to select it first and that's gonna reveal this option for opening our Excel file. And if we click on this, we've got the option to open it in the browser, so Excel Online, or in the app, so this is going to be in Excel Desktop. And when we click on Open in App, it's going to launch Excel Desktop, and here's our file. So how can we change this default behavior so that it automatically opens the file in our desktop app when we click on it? So the first method that we're gonna take a look at for setting the default so that our Excel files open automatically in the desktop app is going to be to change this at the document library level. So this means that any Excel files that we click on in our example SharePoint document library are going to open automatically in the desktop app. So in order to do this, we're going to go up to our SharePoint settings. And here we're gonna choose library settings. Now, in order to see this option of library settings, you are going to be needing to be in the library that you want to change these settings for. And then it's gonna show up here. So let's click on that. And here we're gonna to need to go to more library settings. And in here, we're gonna to go to advanced settings. And here we've got a section for opening the documents in the browser. And here, what we wanna do is choose to open them in the client application. And then we can scroll down and click on okay to save that setting. And if we head back to our example document library and click on this, then it's gonna launch Excel desktop. And so now for any file or Excel file in that SharePoint document library, it's going to automatically open in the desktop app unless we now select it and go to open it specifically in the browser. The next method we're gonna take a look at for setting the default options for opening our Excel files is going to allow us to set this option at the SharePoint site level so that any SharePoint document library within that site is going to have those Excel files being opened in the desktop app. So in order to do this, we're gonna get, again, go back up to our SharePoint settings. And this time we're gonna go to site information. And here we're gonna view all site settings. And under the site collection administration section, we've got site collection features. And if we click on that, then here we've got this option to open documents in client applications by default. And here, we just need to click on the activate button. And now let's go to another document library. And if we click on a file in here, then that's also going to open up the file in Excel desktop. Now the last method we're gonna take a look at is going to allow us to set the default client for opening our Excel files in Microsoft Teams. So we can do this by going up to Team Settings, Settings, and here we've got Files and Links, and we've got an option here for File Open Preferences. We can choose either Teams, Desktop, or the Browser. So we just need to select the Desktop application. And now when we click on Excel Files in Microsoft Teams, they are going to launch the Excel Desktop app and open them with that. So there you have it, three ways that you can set the default client for opening Excel files in both SharePoint and Teams. 
That's it for this video. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel for future Excel videos like this one.